Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm back with another video and today's video is going to be a hair video. So I am going to be cutting my hair. I'm going to be relaxing my hair and I'm going to color and um, mold at the end. So it's going to be a really, really long video. And yeah, so that's what we're doing today. So I haven't touched my hair in like over a month. I've been like washing there and there and yeah so I haven't touched my hair and it's damaged so I really really need a haircut like a proper haircut are you guys ready for this <laughs> so this is my hair it's like really really damaged um, so the only long hair that I have is here and um, everything else is not like leveled so this is really really bad so i'm not sure if it's the relaxer that i've been using the ors relaxer because i've seen like some people um saying it does break their hair i don't know if it's the relaxer or if it's the color that i use so today i'm gonna use like totally different product i'm just gonna take a picker and comb my hair so you guys can see exactly what I'm working with. So, I'm not sure if you can see it, but like as I'm combing, like hair is just like falling over. Like my hair is like so thin to a point where it's just like breaking on its own. So I'm going to do like a proper haircut. I'm gonna have like shorter hair this time. But like my hair is just like falling off my head so the natural part like the short part is fine the only problem is like the top here so I'm really not sure if it's the relaxer or if it's the color that I used last time but whatever it was really did damage my hair and also i've been like neglecting my hair like during this lockout period i haven't styled my hair i haven't done anything i'm just i've just been like washing and giving it like that so this video is going to be like super long maybe i might um make it into two parts but we'll see when I get to the editing part so as you guys can see I only have like this portion here which is longer and like look at back here like I don't even have enough long hair like everything is like damaged it's like broken so the clippers that I'm using they are by wall by his wall so I'm going to use two guides I'm going to start with number six and then I'll see how long my hair is and then after that I'll go with the number five to make it even if this is still too long. So
so i'm done with like the first part of cutting my hair and this is how much i got out so i think the length is fine now it might not be like exactly like equal so i'm going to do a quick relax and then after that i will see if i still have to cut some or maybe i will also clean the back so before applying relax i'm taking some petroleum jelly and i'm going to apply it on my forehead to prevent burning and i'm also applying on my ears and the back So the relaxer that I'm using today is the Stasa Fro uh, Blood Relax. I used to use this relaxer like when I was transitioning from natural hair to relaxed hair. So the reason why I chose this one is I never experienced any damaging when I was um, using it. Another thing that I love about it is that it doesn't make my hair to be like bone straight relaxed. It actually gives it a texture, it's like a texturizer. So I'm going to be using this one. I just hope it will work when I have to like mold my hair, but it makes my hair like super soft and manageable and I still have volume. So this is what I'm gonna use today. So I have my gloves on and I'm going to be using my applicator brush. So I'm done applying, I'm just mixing everything in, just so that everything is saturated. And now I'm taking my comb, I'm going to comb everything.
So I'm done combing now. I'm just gonna wait for like an additional five minutes and then I'll go rinse. So when I rinse, I'm going to rinse like twice with the neutralizing shampoo and then I will rinse again with my normal everyday Tresemme shampoo and then I'll condition and then I'll come back and show you guys the results before I put on the color. So I'm back from rinsing off the hair. I just um, towel dry it and since it's short, dry it quickly so i'm going to finish trimming off the bag before i can uh, put on the color so i'm just gonna use number four so i used six on top here so i'm just gonna do the back maybe from down here up to like somewhere on top of my ears here and i'm gonna do that using number four So I'm done cutting the back, I think it's fine and the rest I'm just gonna leave it like this, like the sides, I'm not even gonna touch. And the hair color that I'm using this time is this, I think it's called Carvel, Carvel, it's like a, an ebony brand. So I'm going to use this one, I got it from Clix and I'm using it in ebony black which is number one and it's a semi permanent color so i'm not using a permanent color anymore so inside there's like instruction and the color i think it's already mixed in here and there's some gloves strengthening shampoo and conditioner so the color is already in here already mixed and I'm just gonna put some of these little gloves. So I'm just gonna squeeze it in. I'm not gonna use the brush. So I think I got all the hair now. So I'm gonna let this sit for about 15-20 minutes and then I'll come back and style the hair. I'm not gonna cover it on anything. I'm just gonna leave it like this. And then um, we'll rinse and then I'll come back and show you guys. So I am back from rinsing of the color and this is how my hair is looking. 
I just towel dried it because I'm going to mold. So this is how my hair is looking now. So I've decided to go ahead and stop this video here. And then I will do the molding and styling on my next video. So be sure to check the next video after this one where i'm going to be molding and styling this hair so if you enjoyed this video don't forget to thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i'll see you guys on my next one bye